Following the cholera outbreak in Rubaga Division, Kampala Capital City Authority Healthy Team has rushed to the area to contain the situation. The team has embarked on sensitization of residents on the need to keep sanitation and hygiene to avert the outbreak. Led by the head of the health department at City Hall, Dr. Mumbali Balam, the team traversed parts of Kaboa, Bikironde and Nalukolongo. <laughs> Uri opa meri bi aja kuitere aje muzi muruzi kuvanga muruzi ruda ni nachi eh kuvanga baka tama singa go mi no kuvanga mazi muga fumbira dara. On Monday, seven people were rushed to Kirudo Hospital with severe diarrhea and vomiting, causing a suspicion that it was cholera. The patients were later transferred to Nagar Hospital, where they were put in an isolation unit. Three people have so far died of the disease in Kampala, prompting the government to create an isolation unit for the patients, as well as rolling out vaccination against the disease. The Minister of Health announced that 11 districts, including Bulisa, Kasese and Arua, that are prone to cholera will receive about 600,000 doses of the vaccine in the next two months. The doctor in charge of the isolation Isolation unit Kato Frederick Murani says the patients they received have improved and are hoping to be discharged soon, adding that KCCA will do a follow up of their hygiene at home. We are discharging four of them now. Uh, we are dealing with some two patients, but most of them they have improved. They have received treatment, we have not lost anybody on the ward, so generally they are very okay. So the cases which we received, they are from Kaboa, from Namuongo, from Ndeva, those are three areas. So after discharging them, it is the KCCA responsible for following up as well, those patients in their communities. In case of hygiene, the toilet habits and so on. Dr. Emmanuel Batiwe, the director of Naguru Hospital, says there has not been any new patients in the last two days, although the hospital remains on a high alert. This is no patient mm -hmm. We're still working on this uh, This report was compiled by Amina Nabidye for New Vision TV.